So what is up? Don't forget to subscribe, check out my channel playlist for individual tutorials on logic, sculpting, animation, music, and more. So if you're making games like fighting games and stuff like that, during the animation it might not finish completely. Um, that's what this tutorial is for. Generally what you want to do while it's animating, you want this to get turned off. Which one is it? Yeah, you want this one to be turned off while the animation is playing. So this is a kick animation. I'm going to show you what it looks like if that wasn't there. And the keyframe is not on keep changes. It's only like that while the animation is in length, as you can see. So I recorded that keyframes press on this. So while that was playing, that right there would be off. So this is what it looks like sort of if that's not there. And you can do this for like all sorts of animations if you want to. If uh, you think uh, this is the problem, then this most likely is. So as you can see, the kick, it, it looks cool, but it's not the way that I made it. It's not uh, finishing properly. However, if I were to add that in there to where that gets, um, you know, turned off while the animation is playing, then it's fluent. It, it's the way that I uh, made it. That's the way that I made it. Also, while you're making fighting games, you want your character not to move in general unless, uh, unless the way you programmed it, it's supposed to. But most of the time, you want it not to move while that's happening. So the best way you can do that is with that same keyframe, just drag those options down. You might not have to drag down this one, but then it won't walk, and you can still use this control sensor for blocking and stuff instead of having a separate control sensor turn on while that happens so that's how you can do that this also works for running animations because um if you're making your own running animations you might not want this one to actually be on and in general that's sort of what this stuff is right here it's just an instant thing that turns on um uh, pre-made microchips with animations that Media Molecule made or somebody else made and then connected it to the proper uh, dials on the right most likely for the puppet interface so it's usually it's usually um, either these right here that are um, turning on these right here we can just go ahead and check just by clicking this, uh, it's it's all it's either on this side or this side that's turning these on. You can like check and see where they're connected. I'm not exactly sure. I've kind of forgotten, but I do know. Um, it's jump apex. You know, let me, uh, where are we at? Jump to uh, where's the jump apex at? Yeah, it's these right here. Jump ascent jump peak, jump descent, sliding. So that corresponds with all this stuff right here. Um, this sets off the walk animation and stuff like that. And that's pretty much what's getting in the way uh, while your animation is um, playing. If you would like to see my combos tutorial, feel free to check that out. This works in unison with that, and I hope this helps your animations. I hope this helps your animations. You just want that to be on while the certain animation is on. You don't want this on keep changes. Otherwise, it'll keep this off. I also have auto look off and um, auto jump off. So if you want to um, mess around with that stuff, and you can turn this down to, you can also turn it off in uh, the motion controls. You can also unplug it right here if you want to. And it's as simple as that. Don't forget to subscribe. Uh, follow me on Dreams. I'm Young Tech's YouTube on Dreams. Check out my channel playlist for individual tutorials on logic, sculpting, music, and more. And I hope this helps your animations. I hope this helps your animations. Another thing you can do is turn off these microchips that are run and jump with the keyframe while this is playing. You can try that. 
um, but in general, if you have a follower microchip, you, won't, you, you, you can turn off all that stuff too, and then it'll turn off the programming for that stuff um, and whatnot. So if you need any help, just uh, let me know in the comment section below. Peace out, peace out, peace out.